Okay, most of y'all don't know. We are Boo Bear Wild Kids and Wilson, you know what I'm saying? Okay, this is what we're going to talk about today, y'all. We're going to talk about the BET Awards, you know what I'm saying? This is my opinion about the BET Awards, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to say this, though. Y'all know me, bad. When, when I was a baby growing up, my dream was to make it to the BET Awards. But I got to know where to go to make it to the BET Awards. I'm a young country singer. I'm a young country rapper. You know what I'm saying? But uh, this is my advice, y'all. I'm going to say this, though. The BET Awards... If you if you're a singer and you're a rapper and you made it to the BET Awards, congratulations, bro. I'm happy that you made it to the BET Awards. I'm not even mad that y'all made it to the BET Awards. I'm really not. But I will tell you this. If you sing or rap four songs of the BET Awards and they ain't give you your respect or your deferential in the BET Awards, I hate to tell you this. They don't respect you. They don't. That's that's the reality truth, bro, of it all. If you make it to the BET Awards, you the foreman. If you singing and rapping the BET Awards, you probably could become a millionaire. And I know every single singer, every single rapper that made it to the BET Awards, they want to get that money. And you can't tell me if I'm lying. Because if I would have made it to the BET Awards and I'm singing and rapping four songs in the BET Awards, I would have been proud of myself. I really would. Because I would have got them. I would have just chased my dream. I made it to the BET Awards. I'm singing and rapping in front of millions of people in the BET Awards and I'm getting thousands of millions of dollars. Yeah, it'd be a dream come true. But I hate to tell you this. If the rapper singers that made it to the BET Awards, they... They are they gave they they are singing and rapping for the fame in the BET Awards just to get all that money. If I would have made it to the BET Awards, I probably would admit that I'm only singing and rapping for the fame, so I could get all that money. That's what us singers and rappers do when we are in the BET Awards, and when we're not in the BET Awards, we try to get that money. You know what I'm saying? Become a millionaire. That's how it is. And I'm telling y'all, bro. I know y'all. I know y'all, I know y'all, I know, I know y'all young people and grown people want to be a part of the BET Awards. But I hate to tell you this. The BET Awards is not the same. I'm telling y'all the truth, man. The BET Awards, they are, the BET Awards are turning to white artists, y'all. We got so many white artists in the BET Awards. Y'all know the truth about the BET Awards? The truth about the BET Awards, back in the old days, y'all, the BET Awards used to be good back in the old days. You look at the BET Awards now. It's different, bro. The BET Awards are different in, in, in 2013, y'all. I'm talking about, y'all remember when we was in 2009? The BET Awards in 2009 was totally different than the BET Awards that we got right now in this world. Tell me if I'm lying. We have singles like Bronze, uh, Will Houston. These are old school R and B singers. If you look at Bobby Brown, these are old school R and B singers, right? Nobody, nobody, nobody doing new jack swing type of R and B songs this year that you know of. But I can say it is some. It is some R&B singers that is also bringing back R&B music. I don't know their name, but I know some some women and some men that's also bringing back that old school R&B music. But some of the artists in the BET Awards, they're not bringing R&B back. We only, we only got four artists that is probably trying to bring R&B music back. And I don't know their names, but that's that. But I will say this, though. The BET Awards... It's not the same. You know what I'm saying? And all I'm telling y'all is that y'all favorite singers in the BET Awards, they don't they, they can't even sing on a microphone. They gotta sing with auto tune, bro. The BET Awards are turning to auto tune. It really is. 
Because uh, I know thousands of, men's of fans in the BET Awards, they want to see a, a lot of male and women singers sing with their will voice. And y'all know me. Y'all be like, why is Chris talking about the BET Awards? Because I can. I can talk about the BET Awards. You know why? Because I make black music. If you're going to talk about the BET Awards, you got to make black music. You got to make R&B music. If you don't make R&B music, you shouldn't be in the BET Awards. The BET Awards are, it's about black news in the BET Awards. Tell me if I'm wrong. It's the same thing with the Grandma Alfie. I can't be in the Grandma Alfie because if I'm not country, they don't want me to be in it. The Grandma Alfie is for people that make country songs. Same thing with BET Awards. They want well artists. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I'm one of the weirdest artists. I feel like I'm one of the weirdest R&B artists in the BET Awards. The Grandma Offer. No disrespect to the Grandma Offer. I think I'm real country news in the Grandma Offer. You know what I'm saying? I got I got so many country songs that I made, y'all. Like four country songs. Other than like singing the Grandma Offer, you got to play instruments, bro. In the BET Awards, we got to play instruments. It's kind of hard. But that's what you have to do. That's how it is. But I'm going to say this, dog. The B two words and the grandma offer. Yeah. But all I'm going to say, this is my last thing I'm going to say about the B two words. The B two words, they don't give, uh, they don't give other people opportunities. I see a lot of people that got a lot of opportunities, whatever. But I'm telling y'all, bro. Not every singer in the B2 was a dance and a singer and a rapping at that same time. We got a couple of singers in the B2 were singing, rapping, dancing. Not everybody in the B2 was can do that. It's difficult to do that in the B2 words. Tip it from mine. And those will, I'm talking about the will. The Will BT was fans. You know what they want? They want that Will 90 R&B music. They want it bad. They want that type of music so bad. I hate to tell you this. I don't I don't even think I don't even think I don't even think the BT was going to get what they want, the fans. I don't even think they're going to get the 90 R&B music in the BT words. I don't think they're going to get it. Because I said it a long time ago. I said y'all know when I said the BT words the not an R&B news that died, it died. It's not the same anymore. It's straight up, you know, it's straight up bubblegum R&B news. We are listening to bubblegum R&B news on the way right now. I get to you sit in your car. We're going to hear, we're going to hear her on the way, yo. You probably going to hear Brown sound on the way, yo. You're going to hear Chris Brown on the way, yo. You may hear Bobby Brown on the way, yo. Bobby Brown, he's, he's, he's old school R&B. And I'd be happy. And y'all fans would be happy to listen to Bobby Brown. He's a world R&B singer. Imagine they put Will Hoos on the way. Y'all be happy to listen to it. Because y'all, that's the news y'all grew up hearing. But all this like. You know, if, imagine y'all play, imagine they play Usher. Y'all going to be happy. Y'all going to be happy to listen to him. Because that's the news that y'all grew up hearing. But yeah. Like I said, I just want to get that off my chest. You feel me? <laughs> but I'm done talking. I'm about yeah. I'm about to just keep my mouth shut. That's what I'm gonna do. What the freak? But yeah, y'all. That's what I'm about to do, man.
You ugly as fuck. <laughs> We got 48 minutes, yo. It's crazy. Hi. Are you from the UK? Because I want to you, my cat. No, like... <laughs> Hey yo, you from LTL? You from STL? Oh my God, the most like bootylish nigga. <laughs> hey, what's your number, baby girl? Damn, what's up, cutie? <laughs> hey, you trying to bang on baby boy? <laughs> Nigga, are you on like a time relay? <laughs> you from, hey, don't lie, you from STL? St. Louis. Wait, wait, what's the flag Ooh, in your background? Me? What's the flag in your background? Nigga, nah, he ain't talking to you, he's talking to a chick on his phone. You gonna have some nigga actually falling from me. <laughs> Look, like, bro, I just want to eat your booty on the one time, bro, and I'll be gone. Just on the one time, bro. I know you won't. Yo. Yo, hey. is this boy part of the KKK? Hey, you part of the KKK? You don't like that. We'll beat your ass, boy. You hey, no, 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 no. Hey, I fuck with the KKK. What's up, bro? Got you eat your booty? Bro, uh, I... I think you turned him on. They're <laughs> <laughs> just looking at each other. No, I ain't gonna lie, but I got big ass forearms, bro. Look at that, look at that shit right there, boy. Look at that shit. What the fuck you looking at, nerd? And I'm talking to you. <laughs> it's dumb people. Hi. Hi. Don't skip us. We're not going to show our wieners. No, because we got banned off on Meagle, so we have to go on this thing. He looks like Matthew Hoover. Matthew Hoover, is that you? Why are you looking at me like I'm some psychopath? Your teeth are whiter than your skin. Everybody go. <laughs> That's my reaction to it. I don't know what this nigga is saying. He's gay. You're gay. He's crazy. Skip. Just skip us. Just skip us right now. To be honest, skip he us. Just skip us. Just skip us. Just skip us. That's all. Just... I didn't know how to do it. Just skip us. Just
I'm sorry. Hi. Why are you laughing? I'm sorry, fucker. I like my lot. It's so flimsy. I like, want to see it. Like, it looks like a whip. I'm all I'm gonna say is this, my nigga. Dude, I dare you to say the N word, bro. You won't. We got 39 minutes, y'all. You in a frat or something? You can talk, bro. Penis. <laughs> no, no, like a negro, a negro, yeah. <laughs> Do you know, like, you have a knee, it grows, so it's a negro. <laughs> I'm looking too shabby, mate.
Good be shit, yeah. Okay. We take one W, y'all. I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm coming to win, y'all. I keep telling y'all that, man. But I would, y'all know me, y'all. I'm the other dog. But for me to take one W, I mean, that doesn't matter, yo. What matters to me is getting everybody to skip me. That's it. That was rude. I didn't do anything to you. Hello? Nope. 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 Side nope. eye. Side eye. Side eye. Hey. Why do you guys look my friends are over? Probably on my bed. Uh You want to know something, bro? You hear me? Sometimes it's not even her coochie that he's thinking. It'd be her butthole. Why is crazy? So not a lot mood. So not a lot mood. How you looking, nigga? Everybody shot. Yeah. Damn. Nigga. Run, nigga, 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 nigga,
That bitch little was crusty as hell. Fucking nigga. <laughs> Give me twenty dollars, I'm killing this dog. Give Yo. Oh. Alright, we got twenty nine minutes, y'all. Come on, y'all. I need to play that song, y'all.
Hey, Zach, that's going to be our TV show song, Zach. I'm telling you, Zach, this going to be the song on our TV show. I know, Chris. I got I to gotta say this, John, Zach. <laughs> hey, Zach, I'm going to put this on my sports movie. This is going to be this is gonna be hard, Zach. I know, Chris. For real, bro. What? Well, I'm a gangster, just like you. I'm a part of your community. That was so racist. That was so racist. I have a question. Before you leave, can you call my IG live and word because I'm too white too? Please? I'm too white. I'm too white. I can't say it. I wish I could, but I can't. It's disrespectful. All my neighbors are black. They're going to hear me and come jump me. Please? Why don't you respond? Is it because I'm white? You racist? You know white people were slaves too back in the day? In a different, in a different continent? I think. Kobe. I didn't really graduate yet. I got all F's. Hey, Tommy. Bro, just call him the N word, please, bro. Just do it. I'll show you my hat. Bro, you didn't plug it in right. No, you didn't. What happens if I put a do-rag on there? Can you just please, bro? Please. I can't hear you. I cannot hear you. Why can't I hear you? Why can't I hear you, huh? Bro, bro, I got the drip on. You see my chain? It cost more than your whole freaking heritage. That was yeah, racist, yeah. yeah. You black person. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Guys, he's taking this beautiful black queen. Look at, this yeah, beautiful, just look at this beautiful black queen, guys. Just look at him. To all my, to all 20,000 of these people on the live right now, look at this beautiful black queen. You got in front of 20,000 people, buddy. TikTok followers for you, buddy. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi, buddy. Why are you just side eye me? Well, pick me more cotton. Yo, that's racist. No, 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 no. I did not mean. Yo, that's. Bye 
I'm about to go to bed. I'm taking these four W's, y'all, so that's how that matters, y'all, to be honest with y'all. Buddy, pussy bacon, pussy boy. I'm gonna stop like a stump cigarette. Hello, talking to you, buddy. Talking to you, buddy. Buddy, buddy, can you hear me, buddy? Bro, are you just gonna keep ignoring me, bro? I'm reporting you to the police. I'm sending a SWAT team to your house. Hear me, buddy? Why are you making that face, bro? See, I told you, Hannah's my girl. Hannah's my girlfriend. We kiss every day. Oh my god. Yes, we do. Alright, we got Remember 19 minutes. Time? Remember the last time we fucked? <gasps> oh, so <laughs> do you like Nutella? Um, I have a question. Can I get the inward pass? Yeah, oh, last night, uh, this, this black person said I can say as much as I want, so I kept like, going. I'm not going to say it right now. Can I say it? So I can say it? It's fine, my girlfriend will let me say it. Hey. Alright, I love you. I guess we take five W's, y'all. That's what we do, y'all. Bullshit, man. Back to great. She be smiling. 
Why are you looking at what your ugly ass bitch your brother? Oh my god.
My Bart Simpson sticker is gonna get moved to the bottom with those stickers. So, yo. Are you laughing, bro? Like, you know. Make a laugh on mute, bro. What the fuck? I don't want to. Are you just going to stay mute? Do you know how to talk? sit here bro do you have tics or something what is happening howdy i can't get up oh. there we go hi you should get boozy fed Right, we got nine minutes, yo. UK. Are you in Kentucky? We are. Cheers. We're looking at a crap pan family of Facebooks. How cute am I from one to ten? Wait.
So tired. Let's do a minute ago. On you. Look like a Billy. Billy! How you been, Billy? Man, that's like Robert. <laughs> Robert! Billy! Billy! Are you coming home? Is he on drugs? Ever. He over here nodding out. Well, he looked up so oh, hard. Bro, he's so hot. He's so <laughs> Yeah. Bro, I'm just fucking so done with this shit. I'm ready to just fucking jump. That bit of in the city. Can I raise you up, Poppy? You want a shot, bro? Take a shot, bro. Come on. What's funny? You don't want a shot? That's whack, bro. It don't matter. She can't be a snow bunny if she's not no. snow. Bro, that three minutes, y'all. Mío, mira lo que acaba de decir mi entrenadora. Duerman temprano para descansar. Está bien para no rendir por falta de sueño. Bueno, no coman pupusas. <risa> es que unos amigos están en El Salvador y entonces le dieron, le dieron dije, recomendación: no coman pupusas, vio. Esa cuaina tiene demasiada. Okay. Es que esa cosa es muy fuerte, vio. Eso, eso no es una tortilla de harina, ¿no? No, vio, pero es que esa cosa, tú sabes lo que tiene. No, viste que ayer acá le había puesto, pues. Porque el de Chupu, mira, Luis, un chido dorado. Ah, arco. Oh, oh, eh, Luis, tú sí le mora de eso, va bien comprando. Ok, ok, man. Wait, wait, wait. Bro, no. No way. There's no fucking way, man. Look at this son of a bitch, man. What the fuck is he doing? Kansas. Sergio Busquets. Got it. Wait. What the fuck? Uh. 
I will got one minute, yo. Please, man, please, man. What a goal! What a goal! Wait, wait. Okay, we got 57 uh, seconds, y'all. Bro, stop. It's okay, this is my advice for y'all, bro. My advice for y'all is to love yourself, ignore the racism, ignore the hate, and ignore the badness. That's my advice for y'all. And my advice for y'all is to stay strong, keep your head up. And my advice for y'all is to inspire millions of people. Y'all see what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to inspire millions of people are different skin colors. And I know I can do that. But we Blue Bear Wildcats in the world city. And we next Kentucky. Yeehaw. You know what I'm saying?